So here is what Fives would have looked like if they didn't change his design. So his unused Season 3 design is so, so different, notably missing the iconic Rishi Eo graphic that we see on the top of the helmet. However, the original design was far enough into production to show up on several pieces of merchandise, including trading cards, posters, and etc. And here's a edited What If concept to show how the scrapped design may have impacted Fives' later look. And honestly, it looks Looks like shit like it just doesn't really stand out with the irishi eel gone i don't know what symbol is that supposed to represent on the original design but honestly it's not iconic it's just forgettable and i'm glad they kept this look because it would have been just boring looking and to the people who don't know what the symbol represents on uh fives his helmet it really just represents the rishi eel the creature that ate one of his members of the squad cut up specifically it's probably meant to memorialize his fellow brother and act as a trophy after defeating the eel back in season one of the clone wars i'm assuming that's what it means because they also do the same for heavy which uh season three episode two arc troopers you could see fives and echo have decals on their armor commemorating heavy sacrifice on the reshi moon it is also an illustration of a z6 rotary blaster cannon with the words for heavy written in uh you know star wars language i guess you want to say and that star wars language is called arabish i still wish cut up joy bait and heavy became an arc trooper squad all together with fives and echo along with them and dave could have made us all depressed by taking them out one by one just like noble team from halo and then we could have actually witnessed a domino's fall fitting to their name domino squad i don't know would have been way cool of an arc in my opinion